mean, wipe your wee nose. You can't be on camera with a snotty nose, darling. Like there you go, I know. I'm annoyed. So, as I say, guys, this is really just a wee extra bonus live um, to tell you that the show on the 26th of February is now definitely going ahead. We've had confirmation of that, so that was really good. We were waiting. Obviously, the guidelines have changed week on week, but now it looks as though they've completely eased restrictions in England. We are starting to ease restrictions here in Scotland. Indoor gatherings are going ahead, so we now have to go ahead. That's why I haven't been, I've been quite quiet uh, on the old social media front for the last while, because I haven't known what quite to say, because I didn't know if it was going ahead or not. But now we have the confirmation it's definitely going ahead. If you've got tickets from before, those tickets are still valid, they'll be in your inbox. Just keep them and show them on the day, either on your phone or print them out, whatever you want. If you haven't got your tickets yet, what are you waiting for? It's going to be a fantastic show. Again, I've had confirmation from everyone who's going to be there. So we've got the amazing Biscuit Town band, Chris Keenan, David Simpson, Chris McGowan. Honestly, brilliant, brilliant musicians. And they're going to be playing with me. Uh, it's all going to be live. We've got a few things that we've rehearsed, but most of the show is going to be down to you guys. It's going to be uh, requests on the night. No, Robin, Iron Brew is not for little girls. You're cheeky. You're cheeky. Uh, so the show, as I say, we're going to do all the usual stuff we're going to have on this day, especially with the live band. We're going to have a very, very special top fan on YouTube on the night. Is, um, we're going to crown the ultimate top fan on YouTube on the night. So that's something that will be really good fun. We're going to have our quiz, as usual. It will be a different, slightly different format because it's live and in person, but it'll be even more fun. There's going to be chances to win bonus points in the quiz by some extra shenanigans. And we have got the amazing, and I've just been texting with Chris to make sure that they were still okay for this. Uh, Chris Ross and that Elaine Master. I know it's funny. I'm going to be uh, playing and singing live on the show. If you've not heard them, they're absolutely amazing. You can follow them on YouTube and Twitch and all sorts of places at dead underscore end underscore old. So it's honestly, it's going to be a brilliant show, and it's all for a brilliant, brilliant cause. Robin goes to a little playgroup called First Step Playgroup in Livingston. It's a playgroup especially for children with additional and special needs. Uh, so they have to provide one-to-one -one care and they do so and the, the staff are amazing. It's a wonderful, wonderful wee place. But like everywhere, uh, it relies on the kindness of the public to run and like everywhere, it has struggled during the pandemic. Uh, so please, 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 if you can, get yourself along. We're looking for some donations. If anyone wants to give us a donation, a bottle of something, on the night or if you run a small business you want to give a wee voucher or something like that uh, so that we can run a raffle and there's going to be plenty of chances on the night we're going to be doing lots of different little things to fundraise so it's going to be really good fun uh, i'm just saying there paul patterson said a wee friday night sing song what about two out of three ain't bad for meatloaf yeah what about that meatloaf that's a great shout from paul patterson so uh, meatloaf died today and it's not often that i'm actually live on the same day that a big, big star like that has died. I was actually quite sad, because uh, I really like Meatloaf. Uh, I've seen him live. It's one of the best live shows I've ever, ever seen. Uh, and uh, Marvin Lee, a day, uh, to give him his real name, uh, passed away today, age 74. So I'm going to do a wee tribute to Meatloaf. Uh, and this is for Paul and for anybody else who is watching them just now. I don't even know if anybody is watching just now, but as I say, you can watch back on the... Uh, on the replay, is that what you call it? Just when you're flicking through, you can watch back, guys. All right. Baby, we can talk all night. But that ain't getting us nowhere. I've told you everything I possibly can. There's nothing left. Inside of here, baby, we can cry all night. That'll never change the way I feel. Snow is really piling up outside. Wish you. I care. Tired of words and I'm too hoarse to shout. But you've been cold to me so long. I'm crying. I 
Passed away today, poor Meatloaf, 74 years old. Brilliant, as I said just before I sang that, one of the best live shows that I've ever, ever heard in my life. It really was amazing. Uh, so I'm uh, going to go in the chat on my phone just to see if there's anybody here. There might not be, as I say, it's a 